Hey, this is Needle7 here. I'm going to be playing a little bit of Fire Emblem Three Houses. Um, last night I started the game and we got a, I don't know, 45 minutes through some of the cinematic prologue and how to play stuff, but we still have a huge ways to go to get through the prologue and get into the game. And so here's going to be another stab at trying to get through Fire Emblem Three Houses. I tried again a lot like a, a while ago, maybe more than a year ago. And I just wasn't able to make it very far just because of all the micromanaging that needed to happen. Let's see, hard, byleth. 41 minutes seems a bit right. Yeah, this is probably where I left off. Alright, so... We're supposed to be looking around the base and finding some stuff going on right now, but I guess we will see. It's been a while. I don't quite remember what to do, and to be honest, I only made it a couple of hours into the game the first time I played through, so here's to Fire Emblem. I really love the, the series, and I really love the battle system. Uh, first task. I know I already looked at this, but I don't remember. Once you have finished, come and speak with me. View quest. May I ask a favor of you? Speak to the three house leaders in each house. Uh, there's some sort of menu where I can look at quests. Be close. X is menu. Quests. Alright, and I've only got the one right now. Sweet. Had to figure out how to travel there. Uh, mini map. Let's bombard me with some more data right now. Mini map. Shows where I need to go for quests or additional quests that I can pick up. Hey, that's one of the house leaders. Sweet. Eldegard is my favorite right now. I do like the uh, dude from the Leicester Alliance. I think he's cool okay. and tricky. And I think they've all got, like, strange pasts. But might as well pick the one that I'd rather hang out with. So you've accepted a teaching position here. Pity. I was hoping you would lend your strength to the Empire. I never properly introduced myself, did I? My name is Edelgard von Hresvelk. Hresvelk. Wow. Again, with the German. I am the princess and heir apparent of the Adrestian Empire. I wonder if you'll be tasked with leading the Black Eagles. I hope you've had a chance to meet everyone. The Black Eagles. Would you like to know more about any of the Black Eagles? Not really, so I'll click yes. Tell me about yourself, Edelgard. Me? Well, some think I'm a bit distant. Arrogant, even. But there's little to be done. One day, I must rise to become Adrestia's next emperor. And she's got purple eyes. What's not to what like? Else? Well, it seems to me that we may have similar personalities. Mm, very good mirroring. Ask again. Um, well, what else? Well. All right, same, same. Hubert. Hubert is the heir of Monte oh, Vesper. Hubert. He has served me since I was a child. You may think his blood runs a bit cold, but <laughs> actually, that's rather accurate. Still, if you can get past that, you'll see he's quite astute and reasonable. And he wears very silly pants. Ferdinand. For some reason, he thinks of me as a bitter rival and is always trying to challenge me. It's terribly irritating. All right, we don't have to put him on the team. His house is that of Dugai, which produces a as as prime ministers. That family is perhaps too pleased with its own status. Hmm. 
That could be some funny dialogue, maybe. Linhart. He's remarkably intelligent, but he only wishes to apply himself to tasks that particularly interest him, and nothing else. He's also fond of, well, napping. Recovers up to 10% self-healing units. Uh, I don't know. D it all depends what his growth stat is like, you know? Sometimes these quiet, lazy characters end up super strong. If he had any work ethic or sense of duty to speak of, I suppose he would be destined to become an official of the Empire. Wow. Cespar? He's the second Caspar. son of Count Burglis. Say he his has name. no inheritance in his future, which is perhaps why he's always so eager to prove himself. He's overly energetic and rushes headfirst into any battle. If he ends up in your care, be sure to keep a close eye on him. Mm. Oh, we'll need some cannon fodder because we're playing on a classic mode. She's Count Varley's only daughter. I suppose you could say she's a bit eccentric, but she seems like a gentle soul. Yeah, I mean, bicycle shorts and a skirt. Definitely eccentric. I believe she shut herself away in her quarters and doesn't care to leave, but don't worry. I'll make sure she finds her way to class. Or we can just not deal with the nonsense. Persecution complex. Grants attack plus five. So we've got a spear and good at bowmanship. If that's a word. Few there we go. have joined the Black Eagle House, but Dorothea is an exception. Yep. And cute hat and earrings. Since Fire Emblem these days has pretty much become zero battle and a dating simulator. Here we are. She's a songstress from a famous opera company in the Empire. I'm not entirely sure what brought her to the Officer's Academy. Songstress. Adjacent allies recover up to 10% of the max HP at the start of each turn. And so, the buff there is probably worth keeping around. Weakness against Pegasus flying. Yep. Knights, good with magic and swords. Petra. To the west of Bodlin is an archipelago called Bridget. Petra is the granddaughter of their king. And she's pretty much good at everything, except magic and studying. Bridget is a vassal state of the Empire. Hunter's Boon grants crit plus 20. Is that plus 20 chance or plus 20 damage is less than or equal to 50%? Hunter's Boon. He's the he's overly axe and fighting. He's magic. For some reason, he thinks fighting. Of his house. Everything fighting. Hubert Bowmanship. Is the heir of leadership. He has served me since you may think. Me. Leadership. Well, I don't know what that helmet means. Distant. What else? Guess we'll see. All right. <sighs> Hello there. Greetings. As for me, uh, and by that I mean. Yes. How do I get Dimitri to be your friend? Go talk to him. <sighs> okay, Claude from the Lester Alliance. Well, well, scored a teaching gig here, did you? Talk about a great first impression. I guess that means I'd better introduce myself properly. I'm Claude Von Regan. 
I'm from the ruling house of the... I'm guessing you don't know which class you'll be teaching yet, do you? I bet you'd like ours. We're not as... Diff Have you met the folks from the Golden Deer House yet? Care to know more about anyone? Not really. <laughs> Piqued your interest, have I? No. As luck would have it, I'm pretty curious about you as well. But what's life without a bit of mystery? Let's just spend the next year or so. This guy is a real sneaky, sneaky bastard. But that's fine. He's the heir of Gloucester territory. If you haven't already picked up on him, he's a bit arrogant and fancies himself. That said... Raphael... Ignance. He comes from a merchant family, but his parents died in an accident. Seems like he's had a rough life. Despite all that, he's just about the most cheerful guy you'll ever meet. His passion. And you're a real bastard of a leader for just not buying him a shirt that fits. He's the second son of a merchant family. Since his brother, if you ask me, doesn't seem like he truly wants to be a knight. He's probably. Lysithia is the daughter of Count Ordelia, and is probably the youngest student, but watch out. She gets angry if you treat her like a child. Marianne is Margrave Edmund's daughter, and that's pretty much all I know. She doesn't interact much with other students. So. Hilda is the only daughter of Duke Goneril. If you look up Lazy in the dick. Leone enrolled because she wants to be a mercenary. I think she said that her father is a hunter. She's pretty blunt and as stingy as they... There's only a few people he knows pretty well. Everyone else he's just knows their lineage. What do you think? people from the Golden Eagle house to speak to. This is the classroom. Our house leads. Cuz we might as well start building up some relationship points with these Golden Eagles. Bernadetta, this is no stranger. Our house leader owes this person a great I am Ferdinand von Eyre, legitimate son of the Eyre family. Legitimate the son. Very house. important. He was born in wedlock. Are you going to join our class? I look forward to getting better acquainted. Bernadetta, did I am first. Are you? Oh no. Oh. There Hello. we go. Aren't you just lovely? Is this your first time in the monastery? Shall I show you around? Oh, my name is Dorothea. Before I joined the academy, I was a member of an opera company in the empire. Is it true that you saved Edelgard? That's nope. incredible. The name's Caspar, by the way. Linhard. Goodbye. Jeez, Some weird Linhard. lolly in my head helped you save so, Edelgard. Are you a student? Thank you. I am Hubert. I heard you came to me. Hi, the Hubert. This back on. Hello. Oh. Some no names. Hey. All right. Hello. Can I zoom in? Reception hall. I can't zoom in, and I don't know where to go. I hate this academy. Like, it's supposed to be all cool and everything that you're running around something like Hogwarts. But, it's just huge. And you get lost. Okay, I've already spoken to that person. Okay. Yes. What do you think? I think I'm lost. You there. Maybe this yes. way. Second floor. Hi. 
this up. Oh, we got pigeons. Let's see. Uh, daddy boy. Here I am again, the office of the Captain of the Knights. That said, I hear the Captain has a hard time keeping up with the responsibilities of the job. Well, you should have said no. Manuela. Oh, Professor! Dropping by so soon? I expected we'd take some time, exchange a few smiles as, well, you're here now. And I do like a man who knows what he wants. Lock the door. Huh. That welcome didn't phase you at all, did it? What's the matter? Don't you like me? Or are you just so innocent you don't understand me? I understand. There was just no dialogue option. Sorry, lady. Crest analyzer. Zikizaki. This is my research laboratory. I've worked hard to furnish it with the rare materials and building. This sucks. Where's the sprint button? Professors are on the second floor. Let me out of here, please. A moment, please. I beg you. Yes. Okay, those doors are open now. Hello. How did this map happen to be on my screen? Oh, okay. Well, it is slightly helpful. Okay, I've already met that dude. Oh, he's right here. Well, I guess the map is useful. Please accept my apologies. I am Dimitri. Of course, delightful news. In any case, I hear you're investigating the different health. Dimitri. Me? Oh, I'm afraid my story has not been... Dudu was born in Dusker and has been loyally working in my service for the past four years. Did you? He's rather taciturn, but once you get to know him... Alright, all the second commands are idiot. Are Felix is the heir grumpy. to House Fraldarius. He has a bit of a sharp tongue, but don't let that fool you. Deep down, he's a good guy. When no battalion is assigned or when a battalion endurance is zero. This is a sweet character. I want Felix. He gravitates. Ash. He's the adoptive son of Lord Lenato of Castle Gaspar. But I hear he was Lock born a colony. He has an. Sylvain is the heir to House Gautier. The philanderer. He is a capable person who highly values his friends. That said. Well, he's always been a bit of a. <clears throat> Skirt chaser, so to speak. Pardon my bluntness. I he ended up in Fire often, Emblem. But it doesn't seem. Mercedes. I hear she was born to Imperial nobility, but a twist of fate brought her to the kingdom. She may see. Nope. 
Annette is Baron Dominic's niece. She is a talented student who scored. She's cheer. Ingrid. Ingrid is Count Galatea's daughter. She is also a childhood friend of Felix, Sylvain, and myself. And has no weaknesses. Holy crap. Grants mount plus three and hit plus five with gambits. Neat. She is diligent. I appreciate your effort. Quest complete. I suppose I should turn return to Rhea. Let's return. Teleport me, please. How are you enjoying your time at the Academy thus far? I hope you have found our halls brimming with the vitality of well-intentioned souls. Hmm. I must note that I am personally against entrusting someone as lacking in trackable history as yourself with such a task. Me too. But it is as the Archbishop desires. Can you just let me lead some battles instead of this nonsense? The Black Eagles, the Blue Lions, and the Golden Deer. All so different. I hope you've made it a point to get to know each of them. Since you are nope, new, I just decided, decided based on luck. Allow you first pick. Hmm, what house will I choose? So you have chosen the Black Eagles led by Edelgard, correct? Yes. Your heart has made its choice then. All I ask is that you guide these open minds. They are all promising youths who bear the weight of Vodlin's future upon their Vodlin. shoulders. It's a dumb name. I hope. Brother? Oh, I am so sincerely sorry. I did not mean to interrupt. Flan. See, it's this, these green haired women, they're untrustable. You've got one living in your head. Some weird time travel things going on there. Wonder if it's the mother of this queen here, the stabby queen, Rhea, who didn't really die, but just got time traveled into your brain. That's it. I figured out the story. I'm in the middle of something, Flame. Is it urgent? No, no, it's nothing. Get lost, More Lolly. This is our newest professor at the Academy. Oh my! A new addition to the Officer's Academy! I am so very pleased to meet you, Professor. I am Sedith's little sister, Flame. I am so happy to make your acquaintance. Who the heck is Sedith? Let us focus on the topic oh, at Oh, that hand. dude. Grumpy there is man. something you should be aware of. In a few days' time, there will be a mock battle between the three houses, intended to gauge the current progress of the students. We will be using this battle as an opportunity to ascertain your own abilities as well. Please. Wait, so our new professor is you? I didn't see that one coming. Easy, Caspar. Aren't you being a bit rude? Yeah, you tell him, Dorothea. Doro? Thea? Rot? What is her nickname? Doro? Rot? Rot? Rothy? <laughs> Hia? Thea? 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 I'll go with th Dorothea. You know it's a, waste a of horrible time name. You can't shorten it. From him. It will be a pleasure learning from you. Now, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> don't look at me like Bernadette. that. Bernadette. Oh, and please don't talk to me too much either. No problem. <sighs> I'm sorry for the chaos you've walked into. I hear we are rather close in age, Professor. Mm-hmm. Are you asking me out, Ferdinand? I hope you do not mind if we treat you like one of us. In our class, we try to treat each other as equals, despite any differences in age or status. Personally, I would love to include you in that inner circle. Oh, I don't get a choice? You have a gut, Professor. I will take great joy from your teachings. You too. You've got a big old gut. Petra, I believe you mean to say that our professor has guts. That's a bit different from having a gut. You 
can't go around saying someone so slim and attractive has a gut. This is why Dorothy is going to be the best. Oh, uh, please take my apologies. I have not yet mastered this language. Professor, I want you to know that it's perfectly acceptable for you to treat me as you do the others. How else would I, I treat a bratty student? I may be the imperial student? princess, but here at the academy, I'm just another student. That said, know that I have high expectations of you, and high hopes, but I'm certain you can lead the Black Eagle House to greatness. Sure, sure. Now let's break the ice with a training session. Sure, sure. I want to see our new teacher in action. Why will the ice be broken? Is this a custom I have missed in my studies? Oh, man. That's going to be annoying. Not real ice, just the ice of... Um, well, it just means let's get to know each other. I don't want to train. Let's stay in the classroom and learn from a book. You are not going on Let's the front lines. Let's all calm down and have a nice Unless your growth stat's quiet. amazing. Doesn't that sound lovely, Professor? Mm-hmm. I know we all agree to treat each other as equals, but there is a limit to what I can tolerate. The esteemed Black Eagle House requires order. <laughs> Looks like your first job will be to quiet down this racket. I don't envy you. His nickname's going to be Eyeliner. Uh, they're not normally this... rowdy. I do hope you can manage, Professor. I do hope we can get on with this game at some point. Weapon effectiveness. There are new places to explore in the monastery. Oh, please, no. A thousand gold. Say, while you're here, I'd like to use this device I designed to determine whether the power of a crest resides within you. Won't hurt a bit. Promise. You don't know about crests? Well, allow me to tell you everything absolutely everything about them is your calendar clear this will take a while mm -hmm. crests are a fascinating topic but before one can dive deeply into said topic one must first understand what crests are they are said to have been bestowed upon humans by the goddess countless ages ago they exist within the flesh and are passed down through bloodlines those who carry crests may excel at magic, display exceptional strength, or any number of boons. Each crest has its own power, the nature of which is beyond mortal understanding. For now. I suspect as much, yes. But we won't know for sure unless, as I said, crests are passed. However, just because someone carries a crest does not only a scarce few descendants of a crest's bloodline, perhaps one of your ancestors bore a crest, and you just happened to inherit. That is how a crest used. Do what you can. Do. There's no need to look into it. Uh, this guy is a suspicious dude, but hiding things makes you look suspicious. So we'll just. Yes, of course. I'll get to the bottom of it straight away. Now then, please go ahead and hold out your arm over this device here. What is this? Ooh, I've got the crisscross crest. The crisscross crest. A pattern I've never seen before. Is it possible an as yet undiscovered crest has been detected? To think. There are still crests out there that even I am unaware of. How? 
pardon my unrestrained jubilation. I have much to consider. You may leave. I have more research to do in regard to this crest. Yes, so... Hmm. What could this line here be indicating? Perhaps it represents a lack of symmetry. What in the... possible to go into battle with the same appearance as in the monastery? What does that even mean? You can set this in the journal by selecting unit appearance. You can now change the protagonist's outfit in the <laughs> to the dancer ensemble in your journal. We'll find the quest by the bulletin board. With each moon, Professors of the Officers' Academy receive a schedule for the month ahead. It notes the days on which events and missions will take place that month. Pay careful attention to your schedule, so that you may thoughtfully plan what you intend to do each month, and when. Managing schedules is what you do for work. Not really. It looks like that's what I have to do, though. So this is my room. What? I have a room? Fresh catch. I gotta catch a fish. Gotta unlock the ability to fast travel. These are not missions I can skip. Visit the dormitory. Visit the dormitory to fast travel there. Weekly announcements. Journal. Unit appearance. Byleth. Attire. Dancer ensemble. Oh. H how could I not do that? That's amazing. In battle? Dormitory, dining hall, fishing pond. Started with the dining hall. Go, go, go. Nope. Yeah. Let me know when you are hungry. I will make you a quality meal, as thanks for your service to his highness. I have a request. This is really faux Hogwarts. I'm busy. Do you want something? No. I can't right now, but let's fight soon. Petra. Professor, if my ways of speak... Uh, of... Well, I call you that. 
But I am afraid I am not a student here myself. Should the opportunity arise, I would love to become a student. The monastery is kind enough to... Might you help me with a favor? Catch a fish. What do I do over here? Ugh. Why can't the... Then what the heck am I supposed to do here? Dormitory. Well, there's, you know, Professor? Professor, I've got a small favor to ask. I tried, but we'll see if it works this time. like eating or you do like eating oh I love this meal how did you know cuz it had a smiley face next to your name nice I knew I could count on you Okay. Fishing is down here. <laughs> exciting. <sighs> Fishing. First select your bait. Uh, press the A button when the circle over the circles overlap. Okay. There's a fishing combo. Caracios. Cultivate. 
or air med water. My thanks. Speak with your house leader at the dormitory, hopefully. The dignity of the Empire rests on the results of the mock battle. Still, we must. You should take the time to learn each student's abilities. Perhaps some extra lessons and training sessions are in order. You look as if you have no idea what's going on here. I know my way around, so I'm happy to help. The monastery has some exceptional. For example, you can enjoy a meal with your. I suggest visiting the. Bay. Have you noticed those? Can if you put the bulletin board is updated. You should take your time. If you use them without planning ahead, your free time will be gone before you know. A great deal is expected from professors of the Officers Academy, so it's important. To put it plainly, you'll need to keep expanding your knowledge of all disciplines, not just battle. I'm supposed to do and other oh, L finish exploring. Thank goodness. It's Ferdinand's birthday. No. Much appreciated. A waste of two hundred gold. mission. Alright. Rivalry of the houses. Yes, let's do it. Save. Do we finally get to do a battle? I wonder if this is actually where it begins where I'll start losing characters. Chapter 1. Hey, we finished the prologue. It's finally time for the mock battle. This is my chance to measure your worth as an instructor. So confident. This will be interesting. It's the dancer's outfit. Each of us has undergone. That means there's no need to hold back. Show us what you're capable of. Hey there. Did we miss our invite to this strategy meeting? No, oh, no worries. We'll just join in now. Yep, yep. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Simply tell me. Ah, so you can't win unless you know my weakness. Poor princess. I spare no effort. Schemes? Me? I have no idea what you're hearing the words fair and square from me. Your Highness is having no wow. need for very. No need Almost. To 
I will two hours of gameplay yes. of not play before we get feel, to the actual first battle. Oh, how precious! Looks like you and the students have become fast friends. While I am pleased that you are taking the initiative to acquaint yourself with the students, I'm a... Ah, how time flies. In that case, I'll see you later, Edelgard. <laughs> what the hell? Dog and cat gift recipes. I don't even know what this is. Magic. You gotta equip magic, and that's the same as it always has been. Battle preparations. Just see how it goes. Units. Edelgard has to go in. And we have to put Dorothea in. So, let's see here. Status, there we go. Nap is pretty good. Okay, we've got a spear, an axe, equipped bow prowess, but he's got no bow equipped. Equipment miasma five, some sort of spell. Equipped with a training sword. Who else has a sword? I have a sword. You're out. Dorothy is in as support. With thunder and a songstress with healing. This is good. Petra, Hunter's Boon, Iron Sword. Petra's probably better than Casper. We've got a two axe users. Iron Axe, 45. What do we have here? Iron Axe been used a little bit. Do I really care about Ferdinand with his Iron Lance? Do I have any other Lancers? No, 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 no. So yes, I guess I kind of do. One Axe Dude. Magic. Magic. Two magic users. A sword user. Lance. And an axe. Seems fairly well balanced since I've got one of those magic users as support. Alright, let's do it. Inventory. Items. It, I guess that iron axe from the first battle must have dropped to somebody else. Combat arts, battalions, reclass, save, I guess. Always a good idea to save. How do we fight? Oh, right in the middle. Yes. Defeat conditions, Byleth or Edelgard falls in battle, rout the enemy. I mean kill everyone. The mock battle is finally here. Will you lead us to victory? Nope. I'm sure you already understand, but the house that defeats the other two is declared the winner. Okay. Incidentally, I'll be overseeing this mock battle, so listen well if you want to win. No. Let's see what's going on. One, two, three, four, five up close. One, two, three, four. That five.
five there, four, five there. So it's a teacher plus four, teacher plus four. So we probably want to head into the trees here. And unless these people run away. Oh yeah, it's the sneaky bastard guy. This guy will be more straightforward. Let's see if we can move over into the trees here. Stay focused. That's my cue. I will prevail. I've got no I've got no long range attackers. That's interesting. Except it just sucks. I didn't plan this out good. Uh, well, maybe As these ma wish. magic people are long range. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. We'll just move away. I don't know that there's a time limit to this. Obviously, you get points if you do it quicker. But let None me of just your shallow tactics are required, Claude. It pull not and I will away from them the a little bit. Me? But I'm not ready. <sighs> Are you making light of our new... Bash, can you move to the front line? Got it, your highness. Leave it. Once you finish preparing, make your move. Did you? Mercedes, keep our enemy occupied until then. Mercedes. I'm on. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> Alright. I need to stand my support next to her next turn. Good. There. Wait. Uh, it needs to be right there. Yes, that'll work. It's not ideal, but hopefully we won't, we won't lose anyone. And I forget how it works. It's a paper, scissors, rock with sword, axe, and spear. This one is probably the most dangerous guy here. Sweet, that dancer's outfit looks awesome on me. Smash, I think the difference between that and a regular axe attack is this breaks their defense and does a little bit more damage. So well, how is that? Okay, finally some level ups. I must Good get proc there. I'll bring her in for the hopefully free level up, Thunder. like this is a horrible idea, but it seems like you get a bonus for it in this game instead of getting punished by magic. Well done, Teach. I may have to take this seriously after all. I'll probably take one more hit from that bow, but hopefully I'll start healing some. You can't stop me! Ooh, nice, crit. Now can I, I he 
heal. Items. Attack. Items. Vulnerary. Oh, that's self heal. What the heck is her special ability? Details? No. Conditions, units. Dorothea. Details. Oh, come on, that's the same thing. View unit. Not helpful. What's her special power? got some sort of thing that's supposed to heal people around her, but I'm not sure how to use it. But you might as well get that experience. Alright. So that's down to two people plus the teach. And then we've got three plus the teach. We haven't taken much damage, but... Hide in the tree, which boosts our agility and defense. Items. Voluntary is a heal. Oh, she did heal a little bit her turn by standing next to here. And he did as well. We will just inch a little bit forward. Bring some Ferdinand into the fight, maybe. Wait. And you can wait too. Are you really gonna fight two houses at once? <laughs> An impressive display of confidence. This is a good opportunity for us. Teachers joining the fight. What will that guy do? Well, let's see how far this person can move. All the way to here. All right. Wait. Oh, not all the way to there. Dang it. We can put Ferdinand in that tree in the front. That'll be fine. That's fine too. And then support right there. Wait. Alright. Let's see what happens. In a lot of the Fire Emblem games, there was a huge advantage to attacking first, but now it seems like you can have an advantage to attacking second if you're hiding in a tree. So we'll take advantage of some of those mechanics while we can. This is Spear, Beat and Axe. I need to look this up. Fire emblem paper scissors rock axe sword spear weapon triangle fire emblem wiki yeah that's what I'm talking about swords beat axes lances beat sword axes beat lances so what do lances beat? Lances beat swords. There's no swords there. And so 
towards the axis. So we'll run up with my sword guy against the axe. Uh, Compact Arts, Wraith Strike. With an Iron Sword. It'll knock him down to 12 health. Attack, Iron Sword knocks him down to 17 health. So, I don't know why yet. Oh, Weapon Durability maybe? It decreases my weapon durability by a lot. That's fine. Ooh, okay. Took a hit back for that. Attack, Iron Axe. Against our Boastress. She can't fight back because they're out of range. Alright, if I can take out this dude. Miasma. We'll knock him down to zero. I'll have one less person attacking me next turn. Even it's not the best defensive position. best right here. And so I'll do the attack from here. Knocks him down to five. That's not good enough. Lance. Combat arts. Tempest lance. To zero, what will a regular attack do? To two. It's got to be Mr. Tempest Lance then. The mark of nobility. All right. Now here and use a vulnerary to heal myself. So I'll block off the main character from getting killed. And hopefully the other people can't reach me yet. The strength. Still unstoppable. We need to pull back here. Attack, force, and free damage. And pull her back for a heal. Let's lance forward here. Attack, Iron Lance. He's got zero health. Alright, so he should be out of it. The noble My training was insufficient. Wait. Let's pull back over to here. Hopefully this will be the last coming out. Nine, 
15. That's fine. He can tank a little bit for me. And they're long range. Alright, that was good healing there. best thing I can do is rush him for some free damage here. I don't know if killing him will end the battle. Hopefully it will. I guess we'll see. He's the general. I don't know if the teachers count for anything. Sweet. And free damage here since it's close range against an archer. Combat arts. Smash. Look oh. at that, a real life character fly. Losing it to shock. Ah! Alright, level up. Let's see what we've got left. If I'm gonna get punished for this or not. Keep losing. I'm gonna get hard punished for this. Dang it. Alright. stand here as support items use a heal someone else. I need a healing spell. Okay, that was lucky. One more attack to shove off the teacher's attack. And he's gonna... That was nothing. Oh, I didn't lose a unit. Sweet, I get to keep Ferdinand in another battle. I should have paid more attention. And the free kill for... Uh, oh. Guard. Your defeat was inevitable. Combat hearts, brave strike. Use it. I'm 
honestly just trying to get through this without losing units. Oh, I must have used my magic book all gone. Uh, that's frustrating. Well, let's see what this combat art can do. Will it finish it off? Yes. This was beneath me. And me too. So you Ah, uh, we've got to finish off the teacher. Alright, let's move as far as we can. Wait. And our heelstress. Just keep pocketing around her. Nice. Does he have any way to equip more items? Items. Out of magic. Ferdinand von Eyre. Wow, Ferdinand von Eyre. The Starothea paying for the free heals is worth its weight. Alright. We got bait over here with no ability to do anything. And we just keep on walking across the map very, very, very slowly. She'll have some support there. Fine. But now we can pile it on. Russian with Byleth with a regular old attack. There's no reason to go all out. Alright, level two. We must all. Is anyone not a level two? Uh, where do I see level level three? Level two? Level two? Level one. Here you go. Here's your experience points. Oh no. 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 I guess I can't do anything. Alright, well... Can't do anything there either. He's got no weapon. So it's up to our person with already the most experience to get even more. Whatever. No. Oh no, 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 no. I screwed that up. If she dies, which she's on the brink of death, then I'm screwed. Should have played it safe. Convoy. Trade. There's really nothing I can do. I'm gonna get screwed. 
and they gave me a pass. This game is helping me out even though it's on hard mode. Okay. Unexpected. We'll move her away. Wait. Let's see what she does with the sword. Attack. Not great. Violet attack. Ma, you fought well. All right. The Black Eagle. Even though it was just a mock battle. Ferdinand gets the MVP. He hardly did anything. Hey, the King Razor. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Total domination. Thanks for joining. How are you doing? Yeah, it was lucky that uh, I didn't uh, lose that unit there right at the end. They should have uh, taken out that damage on me, but they didn't. Excellent work today, Professor. Though our victory should come as no surprise. It was a close call. Oh man, was that it? was the wrong response. That was impressive, Professor. I mean, uh, impressive. We certainly did. I was curious what it would look like if you did not hold back. <laughs> I how so? Don't worry about it too much. I'm all done with being on the battlefield. Okay. You were all as ridiculous. We only managed to win because we worked together. Was it something I said? Mm, I guess. Is it so odd me talking about togetherness? I'm kidding, of course. Come on, everyone. Your work with the students was remarkable. I can see Geralt trained you well. I do hope you were able. Hope you reuse the occasion. Damn. I'm so happy to hear. Of course, the mock battle. You are expected to properly train your students so as not to humiliate the academy during the long. As for today, your class is to dispose of some I'm really just clicking through this because I've had enough for the day. My mission. Those affiliated with Garrick Mock Monastery have a moral. Students are no exception. You shall work to complete the task at hand alongside your students. I will soon provide you with the necessary. I can sense some. Bandits, they say. Oh, our lolly is back. Do you recall when we first met? You shall not fall so shamelessly again, correct? <laughs> Have you no words for me? Do not tell me that you are shocked to hear. <laughs> you ought to know that I am always with you now. To hear my voice. Come on, you can say more than dot dot dot. What is this nonsense? All I was told was to kill as many noble pipsqueaks as possible. No one said anything about the Knights of Damned Sap. You have proven yourself worthless. Distracted by something so trivial. Ooh. I had hoped you would achieve your goal despite the setback. But now. Hey, this isn't what I agreed to. Hiring a mercenary as a professor. What was that? Are you listening to me? How do we finish this? You die. What? Underestimating the knights was an amateur mistake. One you will pick. Now I must locate your replacement. Wait! Get back here! Damn you! <laughs> Save progress, yes. Part one White Cloud. No. Harpstring Moon. Familiar scenery. 
All right. Harp string moon. In honor of the saints whose births or deaths took place under this moon, the people perform music once beloved by those divine beings. Whether by harp, by flute, or voice alone, joyous melodies are shared between farmers as they sow their seeds across the vast plains of Teltin and Grander. Switch, you can do it. Load. As you have already been notified, your mission is to subdue some bandits. Our students have been learning about combat through study, but this is a. The knights will support your mission. In short, this is no mock battle. You you will receive a message from the knights when it is. The last time we fought bandits, you saved me. Maybe I can return the favor this time. The knights are... It seems unlikely. You seem well. Are you adjusting to life at the monastery? Oh. I didn't... When we were mercenaries, I am... Outside of... Ba I thought being thrown into a swarm of... no. But I guess I had nothing to... By the way... I heard about those bandits. Your first assignment. That's fairly routine for you by now. But don't forget it's the first real. It'll be tougher to sleep at night. I wish I could offer you. For now, I'll try. I don't mind you settling into your life. It's Annette's birthday. Would you I like to waste you. some money? No, I would not. Explore. X menu. Save. So we don't have to do that cutscene over. Alright, well thank you for watching and have a good rest of your day. Take care.